Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. I know it's been a really long time since I've been on here, but guess what? Better lighting, so I got a ray light, and a legit background, so I think it was worth the wait. But yeah, so today I'm going to be doing just an easy everyday makeup routine for the fall, I guess, because it is the fall now, which I'm so excited about. I got my little cozy sweaters on now, and I'm so excited. But yeah, if you guys want to see me do this look, just keep watching. So I've already sprayed my face with some rose water, um, so now I'm going to go in with the NYX Shine Killer as my primer. And I've been loving this stuff, so let's just do that. Next, I'm going to be going in with one of my new favorite items, um, which is the It Cosmetics Your Skin But Better CC Cream, and I'm in the color Fair. Um, it does look really white, and I'm s s probably guessing with this light, it's going to look really wet on me, so I just do two, two, two pumps, one and a half pumps onto my Real Techniques, mm, Real Techniques Beauty Blender, and I'm just going to put that, I'm just going to get my mirror because still got to figure out that setup, but I'm just going to put it here. Got it everywhere. I am breaking out down on my chin, so. And then I'm just going to beauty blend that all in. And trust me, I know I look crazy right now, but I swear it's not this crazy, I promise you. <laughs> Ooh, so as you can see, I think I still look really white. Um, but yeah, just finished really blending all of that. Now I'm gonna go in with concealer and I'm gonna go in with my actually new favorite concealer I've loved the NARS concealer forever but it breaks the bank and I found recently it's been being too like sticky on my skin and hard to blend out so I actually um, got recommended um, the Maybelline Fit Me concealer in I'm in fair so number 15 and it literally works just like a charm it's just as great as a Maybelline one if I'm looking down it's because it's my mirrors down there but I'm just gonna put that under my eyes down my nose a bit on my forehead or like wherever I usually have highlights and I'm with my cute bow and I put a bit on my chin that's up to you I don't really get greasy um, or like oily on my chin so I can put that there and I also like just to use it to conceal um, and it brightens it up and usually works so I'm just gonna blend that all in again Okay, now that we're done blending that in, we do have to set it. So, recently I've been going back to my Airspun Loose Face Powder. I usually like using it because it does get messy, so I'm just going to open it away from me because this is a new sweater and we do not want to ruin that. Sorry if I keep on looking in the viewfinder. I feel like I just got to get used to filming again. But yeah, I'm just going to put this under my eyes and then down the nose, forehead. My chin a bit on the sides where I crease because I got chubby cheeks. Let's pop that in. I'm going to let it. Sorry, I was just reaching for the cap. I'm gonna let it blend in for a, not blend in, <laughs> soak in for a bit just to really get that um, to really get that air finished look or photo finished or rare brushed whatever that type of look. So I'm gonna let that bake and while I do that, I'm going to go in with my. New favorite too. I'm gonna have a favorite. Mm, I'm gonna have a favorites video, uh, but a new favorite of mine is the Butter Bronzer by Physicians Formula. Ha! Ha! I love when it stuff falls. Woo! My baby's okay. <laughs> but yeah, going with the Butter Bronzer. So just going to take this Sonia Kashuk brush. It's a bit bigger, just to have like not as a very defined, more of a bronzy than a. Con uh, contour look, but yeah. I'm gonna go on the cheekbones, foreheads, and then down my nose, and a bit on my chin to define my cheeks. Also now, I'm going to wipe away the powder, so I'm just gonna kind of blend, tap it in, and then blend away. I'm gonna go over my eyes too, because I had to put a bit of concealer there. So tap it in, blend away. I'm gonna do that all over my face, and then just kind of Rub it all in, just to make sure I got everything set on my face, because you don't want your makeup to, you know, get ruined. Now I'm going to go in with one of my favorite blushes by Milani, it's in the color Romantic Rose, just as a blush brush, blush brush. Ooh. 
Next I'm gonna go with them some highlighter. I'm gonna go with the Wet n Wild My Glow Highlighting Powder in the color 321B Precious Petals. It's a gorgeous color. I absolutely love it. I'm just going to go the cheekbones. Now I'm going to do my eyebrows. Pretty much all I do is really simple. I go in with the Benefit Gimme Brow and then shade 3. And I'm just going to brush that through. I'm going to need my mirror for this. But I'm just going to brush it through my eyebrows to add a bit of darkness and fill in the spaces. It's more spaces, but... I've been blessed with pretty good eyebrows, so if I don't say so myself. <laughs> now for the eyes, I'm not doing anything fancy. I'm just going to take a random brown color from this eyeshadow palette I have that's a mini one and just kind of brush that through my brows. So, not br through my brows, just put in my crease. Now I'm just taking a flat brush and I'm going to take like any like creamish color and just put that on the base of my eyes just to have a bit of color. Now you do have to make sure that you set your face so I am taking my L'Oreal Infallible Pro Spray and Set Makeup Extender Setting Spray. I'm just going to spray that all over my face. I'll let that soak in. I like doing this before I do mascara because for me, when I do mascara, it always goes, like it always gets smudged when I put this on after. So, I always put that on before. Then I'm going to go in with my favorite duo for mascara for natural look, and it's my Too Faced Better Than Sex mascara, and then to top it off, I go in my Great Lash by Maybelline, and I go in with a waterproof one. Oh, never mind, jokes, this one isn't a waterproof one. I usually go with a waterproof one just so like than smudge. But yeah, so let's do that. To finish off this look, I wiped off a bit of my lips. Not really. I'm too lazy to do that. <laughs> Please don't hate me. I know some people hate that. But I'm going to go with this Too Faced Lip Injection Just Lip Gloss. It's clear and I always just go with that because I don't really need a lip color because it's a very plain look. And I feel like sometimes when I put like a lip color, I just look crazy then because my makeup's not fully done. So let's do this. you guys like this video if you do please give it a big thumbs up also comment down below if you guys have any product suggestions or videos you guys want to see so I'm gonna be doing that I want to post a video at least once a week maybe sometimes twice a week if I really have a lot of time because I'd be really hyped because I got this ring light now and I'm really inspired to do this stuff so let's start doing that um, and also Subscribe if you like the video. I think I already said that, but like it too. Um, but yeah, I hope you guys like this video, and I'll see you guys next time. Bye!